Hi, and welcome back to my garage. We are looking at the left case of the 1985 Honda Big Red. Um, it was having the shifter issue, which I mentioned before. It would upshift, but it would downshift and return to the original uh, spot. So uh, tore into this a little bit. Um, I will say, here's a tip. Um, if you have to take this left case off, um, a Dremel tool works really great. Um, to kind of smooth out this metal here uh, because the case will not clear the frame. I tried loosening all the motor mounts to lift the motor up a little bit to clear it. it just wasn't going to happen. Um, so what I found was um, if you pull the shifter out right here, this bolt that goes right into here supports this area here and it causes the spring to have tension, which would bring it back up. Now, this is the bolt I pulled out. As you can see, this was this dropped out when I pulled the cover off, and this was stuck in the case. Um, to get that out, it took me about an hour and a half um, because I tried using a tap and uh, with an easy out and soon they started drilling it started pushing it into the case started screwing right into the machine which uh, let me know that obviously this thing is not in there very tight so then what I did was um, I had to back it out because I was afraid if I kept trying to drill it out it would go right back into the case and drop and who knows where it's going to be so um, I just used a pair of dental picks and just would push on one end and pull on the other. It took me a long time just to get this out. Um, so the uh, dental picks are definitely gonna be really helpful there. Um, so uh, for this job, I had to order quite a few parts. I had to order um, the starter cover here. I think this is called a starter reduction gear gasket. My gasket looks pretty good, but gonna replace it anyway since I'm in there. This is the shifter seal. Got a little uh, messed up pulling it out. Um, ordered one of those. I ordered a new um, gasket that goes around here to seal it. Um, and then I ordered a new O-ring right here for the starter. So that should keep this whole case, which is right here, um, all secure and sealed. Um, while I had that out, uh, I pulled that carburetor out that was giving me fits and I am sending that off to get uh, rebuilt. Normally I rebuilt this stuff, this stuff myself, but um, the gentleman I sent my other one to, he did a really good job. I made it look like brand new when I got it back. And he did the cold start update um, that Honda did. They offered that as a kit back in the mid eighties uh, to fix the uh, cold blooded um, starts on these things. These were notorious for hard starting in the cold. Um, if you have one that doesn't uh, start hard, starts very easy, then you probably already have that kit installed on your carburetor. So he's gonna do all that for me, clean it up real nice, make it look like new, and uh, put everything back together. And hopefully we'll have a nice, clean, running Honda 250 ES. So the Big Red is coming along. Um, I ordered a ton of parts, oil, ordered new uh, grips for it. Um, so emergency brake lever thing here that actually has a rubber cover that goes on it. Um, new oil, oil filter, uh, pretty much spark plug, everything that you need for a general tune up. Um, and then uh, once I get everything together, I'm going to uh, pull the plug on the rest of the oil that's in there. Um, pull the plug off the back of the differential here and uh, suck all that out put new stuff in and hopefully it'll be good to go for another 34 years so uh, we'll see what happens it's it's moving along pretty quickly um, it looks like a hot mess now but uh, I think I know how it goes back together if not there's enough people on the three wheel three-wheeler world um, that are extremely helpful 
Um, I definitely suggest that website if you are in a Honda three wheelers. Those guys know what they're talking about. Great resource for information, manuals, and everything that you need online. Those guys can steer you in the right direction and uh, definitely help you out. So, thanks again. This is the update 85 Big Red 250 ES. And uh, hopefully, the next video, it'll be all together running and driving. Thanks, guys.